Hello Life Spring Church, I hope you're all doing well, keeping safe and are staying at home during this time. Today I thought I would talk about one of my favourite Bible verses. In Philippians chapter 4, verses 6 to 7, the Apostle Paul says this, Do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your requests to God. And the peace of God, which transcends all understanding, will guard your hearts and your minds in Christ Jesus. There is nothing more prevalent right now than the increasing problem of worry. Worry is a powerful force to disintegrate the human personality, leaving us frustrated, puzzled and bewildered by all the uncertainty that's going on. But in this verse we are told not to worry about anything at all. It may not seem like it at times, but God is in control. In the song Waymaker we sing, even when I don't see it, you're working. Even when I don't feel it, you're working. You never stop, you never stop working. Even though some things have stopped for most of us, like work, school, meetups with friends or family, or going to the gym, our God hasn't stopped, and he never will. In every situation, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your request to God. Let us make sure that we are spending time with God at least once a day. But also during those times when we are feeling extremely anxious or find ourselves worrying, pray to him, talk to him, he is there. Ask him for complete healing and protection from negative thoughts and he will do so. Talk and pray with others as well, friends, family or even small group leaders. It may at times seem impossible to get over such things for some of us who suffer with anxiety, but God turns impossible into possible. Paul also says, give thanksgiving to the Lord. Think of all the things you are grateful for in your life, like the family or friends that you have in your life right now. Or maybe for now having time to do the things you weren't always able to do because you were so busy. Thank the Lord for those things. And finally it says, that the peace of God, which transcends all understanding, will guard your hearts and your minds in Christ Jesus. He is the God of love and peace. He loves us by giving us peace when we ask for it, which is incredible and may be hard to understand, but we don't need to understand it fully. We just need to accept it, accept his love and his peace. Keep focus on the Lord and his word so that both your mind and your heart will be kept guarded from bad thoughts and feelings. I want to also add and finish off with verse eight, which says, finally, brothers and sisters, Whatever is true, whatever is noble, whatever is right, whatever is pure, whatever is lovely, whatever is admirable, if anything is excellent or praiseworthy, think about such things. During this time, it's important that we do not focus too much on negativity, such as people complaining on social media, or fake news like misinformation about this pandemic, which is only going to cause more worry focus on the good focus on the things that are encouraging and help be encouraging to everyone else and of course focus on god and his word and on that note keep safe remember that god is unstoppable and stay blessed